the idea of this whole tournament. It was um, only teams which were not at the top eight of the NSL Invitational Cup number one um, were allowed to to sign up for this. So the top eight teams like Arcea and Excel and others were not included. But never mind. Here we go. We are going live. Round two, game two of this first round. Now it's right in the matchup. Pre caging versus Discord, and I did the scores again. So. <laughs> <laughs> well, let me check that again. Oh, damn it. Swap. Pre-caching. Pre-caching is an elite one all. There we go. Now it's complete. Alright. Versus Discourse. And Discourse is now going with a pretty strong 5-0 or 4-1 split. Just one scouting um, the hub. And I like that. But Pre-caching going for a 1-1-3. One, one, Pressure and they have to watch out, not gonna get base rushed here. Pipo, if you can kill one alien, it's gonna be really huge. The aliens are yeah, not standing still. They're going for base, base rush. The commander just locked in again. And the Marine from Logistics has to come back earlier. A little bit late. CRT alone with the spawner Pipo and both gets taken out. We only have Oh my goodness. Four skulks in a base. Nice shooting here by Crocodile. Getting the first one. Still three skulks alive and the IP is getting pretty low. And boy, that was close. So at the same time, oh, that base rush, the, the aliens are about to get egg rushed. Oh my god, what a short game going on. Oh, it's only one Skulk alive. He's in a tier. This Marine needs some med packs. There we go. Set him on two Marines and they drop the Hive in Warehouse. Just to, well, not get base rushed. They still are. And, well, they're still egg locked. Swan Skull jumping around, trying to get some cover for the next spawning X, but oh no, he does go down. Really unfortunate. He needed to stay alive up to the next spawner, and this looks pretty grim here for Discord. Completely failed with this opening, and you really have to watch out with aggressive 3 1 1 split by Marines. If they keep moving to a hive, you have to instantly, before you even decide to you go for base rush, at least jump out as Gorge and get Hydras up or anything. Do something. Usually what you should, or usually what most teams do, and what I would suggest to you is um, actually go defend it, kill the three-man pressure group first before you do anything else. We try this out so often, versus Goat and other teams going with three one one pushes and, well, you get egg lock really fast if you fail with your base rush. And that's exactly what's happening now, Discord is about to lose their main hive, Vero's hive has grown about halfway, but it will not help them. Um, the Marines will notice pretty shortly there's still another hive, and exactly right now. There's no ops that they not, cannot scan, but what they can do is they can drop Ghosted CCs to figure out where's the hive, and they're probably marching. Yeah, they know it already. They know it. And Lyson is calling GG pre caching Wins 2 0 with a pretty fast second game with this oh, base rush, base straight scenario, which the Marines did win in the end. So nice job pre caching Taking this first match by a GO score and having a good lead and a fallout for this tournament.